gibt. Rude. Yes, let us have uh, this. Yes. Have all the booze, my dear. Right. <laughs> Let's enjoy ourselves tonight. Oh, we're starting with the big questions, are we? Hmm. <laughs> what the heck? No, I've never thought about that. You think about what it'd be like to be a girl very often, Rina? <laughs> I mean, I, I think you already know what gender you are, I'm just saying. <laughs> That's a lot of whiskey. I know! I'm not complaining. Uh, what would you like to do if you were a girl? If I were a girl, let's see. Um... Even if I was a girl, my fashion sense would probably be as atrocious as it is normally. Uh, go to the woman's side of the bath? <laughs> oh, good lord, what have I got myself into with this one? Um, <laughs> it's a trap. I'd want to go to the women's side of the bath. There's a guy. It's a holy ground we never get to enter. A lot of men would probably give the same answer. <laughs> Hmm. I guess you have a point. So I'd really have to think about what I do as a girl, both physically and mentally. Okay. I think it's dangerous ground to... anyway. I guess so. So, what about you? What would you do if you were a guy? Oh yeah? I thought you'd have, the, have an answer prepared already. Something like, I'd want to be surrounded by cute girls. Well, I think I think Rina's got a new got a new fan in chat, right? Maybe I like them because I'm into my own gender. So if I were a guy, maybe I'd be attracted to a cool buff guy. Or, um... Uh... Uh... You don't like yourself? Oh crap, no, that was certainly not why I was going with that sentence. Um, okay, fine. Yeah, no, that's... Oh god, I'm fine. It's like I'm playing Fallout 4 again. Right! <clears throat> you don't like yourself, I guess. That's why you fall for who you think of as an ideal version of you. Alternatively, I got the... <sighs> I think I'm gonna go and become a monk. I think I'm just gonna move to a mountain somewhere and become a hermit or a monk and just... What? People confuse me. Right, okay, fine. Um, You know, I think you're right. Even if I get along with someone, if she isn't cute, I can't fall in love with her. Alternatively, no, that, yeah, no, that, that, no. Uh... <sighs> Uh, 
I, no, no, don't do. No, I, I, no, that's. Uh, here you save this, right? <clears throat> hey, everyone has faults. At least you're acknowledging your failings. There's more than the, that's more than most people could say. I think you're fine just the way you are. Come. Saved? Pink? Yeah, and I mean what I said. Order something else, I think. Um. I will go for a. Root? I mean, uh, uh, I'm gonna with I'm going with the chicken nuggets to be honest. <laughs> I want this. Okay. What? You want a present? Yes, because a hostess club's a good place to take your girlfriend on a date. Even I can probably conclude that's a bad idea. <laughs> hmm. No need to beat around the bush. You want someone special this time of year too, don't you? Yeah, I can get behind that. Christmas I guess so. Oh, wait a minute. I've not checked. No, I can't. Oh, oh! I can control the camera! Okay, cool. Um, I guess so. But living in Tokyo, there's a lot of people all year round. What's the point in worrying about it? So, no, I don't like crowds either. <laughs> Quiet places are much nicer. Reach, my brother. Camarocho is pretty is pretty hectic, and I'd love to find a calmer place to live someday. Let's see. How about Okinawa? Yep. Uh -oh. mm. eh. Yeah, that's true. The main area would be crowded. But if it's an island away from the main one, it'd be nice and relaxing. Right. It'd be great. Uh, uh, it'd be great to be able to live like that. Order something else. Order something. Let's order a dessert. Um. Oh. Ah. Could I have ice cream? Ooh, chocolate stick. I'm going with the chocolate. I like Hello. chocolate. Ooh, hello, we hit the shiny, bloody, bloody, bubbly thing. It, go, it went swing! My dear, after your previous question, I'm a bit worried about what this is going to be, but okay. Uh, do they? I... I probably... I... Anniversaries? <laughs> well, that was more of a marriage thing. I'm doomed, aren't I? Um, right. I think most men remember when their girlfriend's birthday is, or a wedding anniversary if they're married. Yes! Exactly! That's not the I, uh, 
Help! I don't know what I'm trying. It's this important. There's too. There's too many anniversaries. I don't know. I. Am I. I. I don't know. The, the idea of going off and becoming a monk is starting to sound ever more more likely for me. Right. Okay. Um. Our next date is our tenth, and I want to take you somewhere special. I. 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 I what? I, I don't know, but in fairness, you were fine, Rena, because if women are much better at doing this sort of thing than technically any of, then you go, your girlfriend will remember all of these perfectly, and that is the important thing. I think I might be completely missing the point here. Not a problem. So that's what you meant. And that's true. Most men probably don't keep track of that much detail. No, maybe. Well, I don't. But then again, oh lord, right? Now I couldn't tell you when I took my oath or the number of times I've had my inquiry touched. I'd have to guess. So that's uh, um, it's the thought now that the yeah I was gonna go. It's the thought that counts, but that seems like danger. Um, that that we forget, or yeah, we shouldn't forget. Ah, uh, better that we forget. I'm curious where this one's going to go. She's saying that lesbians are taking over, taking over all the girls. Um, I. Sure. Sure. I mean, I mean, we did run into her previously outside a cafe, just chatting up random women and offering them tea, so... Yes, maybe... I... What? <laughs> sure. <laughs> what is my life? Um, yeah, we'll go with that. What were we doing? All right, it's better that we forget. If we had to keep track of all the different anniversaries, we're bound to get worn down. And forgetting about the past means that each new day is even more satisfying. No, I think that's a sign of a longer-lasting relationship. Uh, oh, dear. Oh, you figured that out, did you? <laughs> um, I mean, no, 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 we're not, I'm not making this up. No, I, this is, this is a truly inspirational, that hurt. Ow. Um, yes. Um, well, <clears throat> well, that wasn't my intention. Are you worried about this? It's a lot to remember. <laughs> I mean, I've got a smartphone, I, I, I could throw all of them into my calendar, but at some point it's going to get a bit ridiculous when you basically stood there and go, Yes, uh, it is our 4,228 date since the year 1942, my dear. Yes, yes, we shall go off to the, uh, the things of Babylon because that is where we went for our 2,047th date. And it's just, no, that's just bollocks, no, just, no. <laughs> Hmm. Oh, I've had enough drinks. No, I'm good to go. OMG, babe! You've just we've just held hands for the hundredth time. Let's get some candle uh, light candlelight dinner. Exactly. Exactly, Jambri. What do you want us to do? Write it down. In fairness, if I had to, I would write it down. But because otherwise I would, and even then I'd forget to keep tabs on it at some point. I, oh lord! Right, seventy-seven thousand yen for being asked what I would do if I was a woman, and then getting told that I uh, hello, I'm told that. So basically, we turned up. I got my sense of fashion insulted. Questioned on what I'd do if I if I was a woman and fought like a woman and then lectured about how men don't remember anniversaries um 
Okay. <laughs> okay, sure. Um, it was really fun. Yeah, I had fun too. Well, I mean, yeah, I mean. Yeah, okay, I'll concede that. I suppose it was quite an entertaining conversation. <laughs> and we've ranked up to rank D. Marvellous. I think we had a better chemistry with Gromi Chan. Just saying. Okay, right, well, we've done that. So, what to do next? We could go and talk to Rena again, but I don't think my sanity will probably take it at this point in time. We could go into Asia, but there's no point really because that's just wasting time. I know, hypocritical coming from me. Um, we could do some of the story. We could fight these dudes, which we're actually about to do. We could try the other hostess club. I'm curious now. I mean, it couldn't possibly be any worse than... Well, well, I say worse now. Worse is the wrong... It couldn't be any more... Um, Mind-bending? That, that seems more accurate. Maybe I'm better off single. Right. Lonelier, yeah? but it doesn't have quite as much of a headache to it. Oi! It's off! Oh, that's more people down. Onwards! Hmm. You know what? My curiosity's got the better of me. We'll save the game. And then, we will venture into the world of Duel. I don't. Or we could go to Meb and get some information. Hello. There we go. There we go. Right. Meb. How many pretty girls? Anyway. Tell me about Jewel. From here, head east on Bradley Blair to the left side. It's a pretty classy place, and I'd highly recommend it. Jewel makes it a point to hire only the most beautiful women in the, ci the city has to offer. If you're a first-time customer, my recommendation is that you talk to Yui Chan. Uh, no, I'm all right. It's literally down the road, mate. I'm fine. I can get there. Well, seriously, why do I have to go and talk to a random man in a random shop about a cabaret club before I... Oh, whatever. I suppose that makes sense. You go and talk to him and find out information. I just went... You son of a ding! I just talked to him! Do I have to have him guide me to the... Okay, fine. Tell me about Jewel. What's wrong with me just walking through the front door? Here we are. Yui Chan's a really sweet girl. Uh, you should have a very nice time. Marvelous. Let us do the thing. Hello, sir. Welcome to Jewel. Our prices start at 8,400 yen for the night, plus a service fee of 3,150 yen. 
if you would like to request a particular girl, that will cost an additional 3,150 yen. Would you be interested, sir? Yes. We have a table open. Please follow me. Uh, uh, um, hello. <laughs> It's nice to meet you. I'm Yui. Right, here's my business card. Okay, we've received Yui's business card. May I ask what your name is? Kiryu, cousin. Uh huh. Kiryu san. Nice to meet you. Uh. Yeah, likewise. Um, uh, Yamazaki 12, please. Turn up. One, this one. Oh, that. Okay. Of course. I heard that when someone gives you a business card in Japan, you have to look at it in detail and inspect it, otherwise it's seen as rude, as the card is an extension of that person. Yep, yeah, no, that's quite right. So if you're in a business meeting, the person gives you your card, gives you the card, you take the card, you look at it, you go over it, you go, oh, yes, 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 that's a very nice, a very nice card, yes, yes. And then if you either put it into a card holder, or you put it on the table until the meeting is over, in sight of the person, what you do not do is you take it and immediately stuff it into your back pocket because that it's not really yeah that's not seen as the polite thing to do yeah business cards are a big thing in japan big thing i brought in japan did a thing on it at one point um kiryu san did you have work today no actually i'm not really working right now so I guess I did have the day off. Uh, kinda. <laughs> I was in prison. I was in prison. Mm -hmm. Yeah, dead serious. Oh, close. <clears throat> Oi, oi. Um, um, isn't that the part where you change subject before it gets more awkward? It's a secret. Ah, <laughs> 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 she has a cute voice. She does indeed have a very cute voice. I liked her outfit as well. What can I say? I mean, Rina's outfit's, I suppose, cute with the bow, but at the same time, just I, I quite, I'm quite partial to the whole Japanese, the Chinese dress thing. It's quite nice. Anyway. <clears throat> There's a case. I can drink in peace with you. I'm mm -hmm. sure. At least I'm not like that bloke who we bought all that used women's underwear for. Once again, that was a weird side story. What is that? I mean, yeah, okay. Mm. That's an interesting outlook for a host nurse. Wouldn't it make you happier if the customer ordered more? That's actually a very fair point, yes. What do you mean? Mm I see. So that's what you meant. So you could add them all. Ego the Sarato Kawaste, Moto Takao Saketu Mosa Serekoto Kairukedo, Yoku Kokoro Gaitamana in Arte Omono. Demo, Sonoki Sasteoite, Ato de Kotoaruto, 
面倒なことになっちゃいそうじゃないだから私は初めからいくら貢いでもお客さんには絶対惚れませんっていうことにしてるの。At least you're honest. <laughs> But it's true that lots of guys think they can go out with a girl as long as they throw around a lot of cash. Like that? <laughs> oh, you like her that much, do you, Jemry? Well, fair enough. Nah, it's all right. I, well, yeah, nah. VIP. VIP benefits you don't get slapped for spamming. Hail, great smoozer. Hail, Commander Kev. Welcome. Desho? Great smoozer. Yeah, me who just know women break, brain hurt, can't talk, think. Owie. Anyway. Right. Um, uh, although they might partially be honest, uh, the host has a fault for knowing all that flirting with them anyway. Need. They have that effect. Good to know. Watashi wa soyu koto shite made, jibun no junyi agetai to omanai no yone. Well, yeah, she's got a certain amount of honor about her. So that means I don't have to spend a lot of money here, eh? Well, I guess I can order whatever I want. Haha. Dozo, dozo. Yappari tanoshiko sake ga nomeru no ga ichiban yone. Yeah, I'll drink to that. I'll order something else then. I will order. I rave thin. Done. I want this. Saikin, eh? Nani can I go to Hazime or can not tell Motel? Okay. I see. Way to go. Uh, why go back to school all of a sudden? 他の子を見てて思ったんだけどやっぱり昼の仕事を持ってる子の方がお客さんとの会話が弾む気がするのああその点私はお水の経験しかないからお客さんに聞いた知識くらいしかなくてそんなに話広がらないんだよね Fair enough The more experience you have in life the more of it you can draw from to talk about But wouldn't it be a lot of work to get a job for just some extra material? So na no yo. So re de narai goto nara jibun no pace de smerare ru si. Tojiu de yamete mo dare ni mo mei wa kakara nai kana te. The sad eyes. I mean, yeah, it does look quite sad. In fairness. I was trying to pinpoint on what it was, but yeah, I think you're quite right, Kev. Anyway, <clears throat> um, uh, that's why uh, even if I quit, I won't trouble anyone. Also, now that I think about it in context with what she just said, hmm. Well then, you've already thought this through. You know what class you're going to take? Well, I mean, martial arts would be my idea, but um, cooking class. I'm going martial arts. <laughs> How about a martial arts class? Kakutogi? So that's boxing or karate? No, a good karate club if you're interested. Huh. Yeah, martial arts are pretty popular these days. There'd be a, there'd be a lot of men who are interested in it. Not the same. Yeah. Quite boring to watch martial arts, if I'm perfectly honest. That'd be too mundane. Wouldn't it be more interesting topic if you did something that most women can't do? Oh no, no, nobody gets hurt doing martial arts in the slightest. No, not at all. No, 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 no. No, it's a perfectly safe thing. Nothing ever bad happens. No. Oh, right. I guess I wasn't thinking, I was thinking from a man's point of view. 
せっかくだけどそれは無理かなごめんねキリュウさん That's all right. No, it's fine. Now I'm going to order something else. Chicken nuggets. Done. Hi. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. Oh. Plastic surgery? As in changing her face? What on earth did she do to need a new identity? Honolid to a creased lid. Good. I love how me and Ryu had the same reaction to that. Oh, back in the old days, girls just wore more. Uh, uh, wait, did it? Back in the old days, girls just wore too much makeup. So, how is this causing a problem? Ah, so so. So then, eh? So no, what was that? I got kicked out. Shut the. Sexy is not the right. Okay. You can leave me alone. I'm not going to get into trouble. Sister's choice. <laughs> Sister's body, her choice. She's an adult now. She can take responsibility for her own actions. Unless she isn't an adult and she's only like 12 years old, in which case, no, that's a really stupid idea. Here you here living in 2050 with his attitude. <laughs> I guess so. It'd be a different story if she said she wanted to get a tattoo, but it's just her eyelids. I don't think it's worth making a big deal about. Ah, I'm not going to do a tattoo. I'm not going to do a tattoo. I'm not going to do a tattoo. Tell me about it. It's a real pain. Eh? What did you say? Nope. Thing is, yakuza don't call them. It, uh, there's a uh, for the yakuza. It's a uh, it's a different tattoo. I forget the actual word, but tattoos are something different. So, at least going off an interview I saw with an actual uh, with uh, an ex yakuza, I think he was. A tattoo is the the thing that you basically get on your arm and you show off to the world whereas in the tattoo that like the likes of Kiryu's back tattoo or any yakuza tattoo it's something that's supposed to be hidden it's a sign of your rank and etc but it's not something you go around showing off i think that's the how it all works i probably I really should watch that interview again anyway <clears throat> your terms almost up sir no i've had enough to drink i'm ready to leave understood sir Probably quite expensive as well, considering Kiryu mentioned he has to get it touched up, so that's probably going to cut off their whack. Didn't do so well on the whole heart meter, did I? Right. Kiryu said, please come again soon. <laughs> I like you, and I'll request you from now on. And I'll be waiting. Ow. 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 There we go. Right, that's another thing done. Um, now what do we do? Uh, there's the park. Pocket circuit, which we can't do just yet, and there's the drunk man. I mean, I'll tell you what we'll do. I think there's a convenience store around here. Yeah, there is. We'll go to the convenience store, get some alcohol, go and talk to the drunk man, and see where that leads us. Also, where are we on the complete? We've got 15 completion points as well. Hello. Oh. You want to fight? Okay, I'll give you a fight. 